you come gathering with me? Hmm? Why are you asking all of a sudden? I don't have any materials for synthesis. I want to go gather some, but I'm scared to go alone. Ah, I see. Of course I'll go. Besides, you helped me with Meister Horse request. Alright! Thanks, Monica! No problem. By the way, Sophie, have you outfitted yourself properly? Huh? Yeah, I have my handkerchief and snacks. That's not what I meant. You need medicine and other supplies, right? We're going to a place where monsters appear. You need to prepare properly. Oh, you're right. I'll be sure to bring some stuff. Why, if it isn't Sophie and Monica, are you going somewhere? Oh, Mrs. Marguerite! Yes, I'm going to help Sophie gather materials. Right, Sophie? Wow, these are nice! Your vegetables look so tasty today, too! Yum! <laughs> It seems Sophie is charmed by my vegetables again. Sophie! Huh? Oh, right! Yeah! We're going to go gathering! I see, I see. Make sure to be careful. Yes. Thank you for your concern. That makes me wonder where my foolish son wandered off to. If you see him, tell him I'm looking for him. Got it. I'll let him know if I see him. Anyway, we'll be going now. Yes, take care. Where are we going next? Ah, the 
fresh air is great. I feel like I haven't been outside of town in a long time. Sophie, you need to be more careful. We have no idea when monsters could appear. I know. Wait, is someone over there? That's... Hey, Oscar! Oh, Sophie and Monica. What are you doing out here? We're here to gather alchemy materials. What about you? I came to observe the plants. The plants here tell some interesting stories. Oscar, don't tell me you were talking to plants again. That's exactly what I was doing. What's weird about that? To me, it's weirder not to be able to talk to plants. Yeah, you were always like this. I don't really intend to argue after all this time. That sounded vaguely like an insult. Oh, right. Oscar, Mrs. Marguerite was looking for you. <laughs> oh, crap! I totally forgot about my delivery! Mom's gonna scold me! This is your own fault. Just accept it, Oscar. Huh? What was that sound? Ah! Uni! Sophie, stand back! Oscar, you can fight, right? What? Wait a second! I'm not prepared for this! Here they come! All right, let's take these guys out quick. Somehow, I didn't think they'd attack all of a sudden like that. Hey, Oscar, do you want to come with us? It's dangerous to be alone. Monsters could attack again. You're probably right. All right, I'll go with you. I wouldn't want to get hurt after all. In that case, let's get started with the gathering. Oh, you need to help too, Oscar. What? I never said I'd do that. We won't tell Mrs. Marguerite we saw you here. Okay? Uh, fine, I got it. Plenty. <coughs> Talk 
about using people. What should we do, Sophie? Want to look around a little more? Huh? No way! That's enough! I'm exhausted. But if we stick around too long, some dangerous monsters could appear. Hmm. Oscar might be right. Okay then, let's head back. Yeah! Oh, both of you should drop by the Atelier. I'll make tea for you. Oh, really? Then we'll take you up on that offer. Right, Oscar? Yeah. But first, let me catch my breath. the voices of books in addition to plants. N no Oscar, it isn't just you. I can hear it too, this time. Sophie, it seems your friends are just as loud as you are. <laughs> I'm pretty sure anyone would be surprised if they saw you, Plakta. Um, both of you, this is... wrote something in a reference book and it started talking? Sounds more like a dream. I never thought that book would turn out to be something this amazing. I was shocked at first, too. I mean, a book was flying and talking, after all. I don't think it's that shocking. No, it is. So, um... Miss Plakta? Just call me Plakta. Oh, okay then. Plakta? What or who are you? Ah, I asked the same question. But it seems like Plakta doesn't have any memories. Really? Yes, the only things I know are my name and a little knowledge of alchemy. Right. That's why I want to figure out a way to get her memories back. Memories, huh? Maybe they'll come back if you found some sort of clue? A clue? I just thought of something. Plakta started talking because you wrote something in the book, right? Yeah, I think that did it. Then maybe her memories will return if you write more recipes into the book? Wow, that makes sense. You're pretty sharp, Monica. What do you think, Plakta? It doesn't sound far-fetched. I think it would be worth trying. Okay. In that case, I'll study lots of alchemy and write lots of recipes into you! I feel like some sort of fate brought us here. If there's anything I can help with, let me know. Yeah, I'll help with whatever I can too. Thank you both. Whoa, it's getting late. I need to get home or Mom will scold me again. I'll be leaving as well. See you later, Sophie and Plakta. Yeah, see you! need to work hard for Plakta. Yes, I have high hopes, Sophie. Alright. 
time to start synthesizing. Clock Duff, teach me whatever you can. Okay, I understand. Okay, what should I make? What materials should I use? What materials should I use? Is this really okay? Okay then, let's start! the results. Alchemy is based on creativity and ingenuity. You should remember that. Creativity. Okay, I understand. By the way, Plakta, I want to try making something else now. <laughs> that also depends on your creativity. Huh? What do you mean? There are various things you experience during your daily life. Things you see, hear, and feel. If you base your creativity off of that, you may come up with new alchemy recipes. Hmm. So you're saying I should do all kinds of things? I suppose that would be putting it very simply. Uh, okay, I get it. I'll just try whatever comes to mind. Yes, you should try that. At the very least, the experience will be good for you. 